Cavern of Eye Associates of South Texas. I'm going to show you an implantation of a recently approved intraocular lens. This is the Technus Synergy intraocular lens, which is a combination uh, depth of focus and diffractive intraocular lens implant. Uh, we mark our cornea using a toric marker, and it is at approximately 170 degrees um, axes. And you can see our capsular bag is clean. I do not routinely clean the anterior capsule or vacuum it, as I find this helps toric lenses uh, stay in more stably uh, if the anterior capsule leaflets are not uh, polished. This Synergy intraocular lens implant is preloaded in the Johnson & Johnson injector that will go through a 2.4 millimeter incision quite easily. We're putting some sugar cane on the cornea to give the patient some anesthesia. As we place the intraocular lens implant, we use a Sinsky hook to stabilize the eye as we inject in the intraocular lens implant. And screw mechanism injector and you can see the lens is delivered in a very controlled fashion into the capsular bag. Once the lens has been injected, sometimes the haptics will stick to each other and they usually release on gentle manipulation. You can see the intraocular lens has been placed into the capsular bag. The haptics have just released, delivering them into the capsular bag. And we're going to get the axes of astigmatism of the toric intraocular lens implant matched with the corneal markings. We, of course, double check these with a Aura OptiWave refractive analysis system for our final positioning. The lens is well centered and the toric marks are in good position. The viscoelastic will be removed after the position is confirmed with the Aura analysis. Thank you for your attention. This is Dr. Kavanaugh of I Associates of South Texas.